Well, when I think about my role as a female leader and one who has uh, accomplished a number of firsts, I think about the fact that it certainly brings pride to my mother's generation because they paved the way. But I also think about the fact that it gives my daughter's generation something to aspire to and it gives me something to help them with because my theory is that if I'm the first and no one comes after me, then I have failed at my responsibility. You know, I'm old enough that I remember Shirley. You know, she was she was somebody, she was a friend, uh, and I had the sense that it's been long enough since we lost Shirley that we were starting to lose recognition of who she was and what she'd done. Uh, and it struck me that we ought to do something. Uh, it actually came out of the fact that we were renovating the fifth floor and there's a conference room on the fifth floor that was, was named for Shirley and we were going to lose that conference room. And I thought that was a tragedy. I mean, that, that, that you know, there would be no more recognition of, of Shirley at that point. And I said, we really need to, to do something to sort of bring her memory to the forefront. At the firm, I'm also the firm's parental leave liaison, so I work with young men and with young women um, uh, when they take paternity leave or maternity leave. So I can tell you that uh, spending time with their families and being committed to their families is just as important to the young men as it always has been to the young women. So on the one hand, I think this actually provides a great opportunity for young women because when men put as much value on spending time with their families as they do in billing hours, it kind of puts us on more of an equal playing field. Julia is the best. She is a great advocate for both men and women, and I think that that's a really important aspect to, to Julia's leadership, is that she kind of understands the equality and making sure that everyone is being treated you know, the same. But I think what's important about Julia as a leader is that she does recognize the kind of unique challenges that face women, and she really works not only to say, okay, here are these, you know, here are these challenges, but she works and says, okay, and here's how we can address them.